All right, guys, navigate Lesotho about to start. Ryan and Rainer, be safe out there. May God bless you. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice. Enjoy it, guys. Thanks so much, guys. See you in about a thousand kilometers and over 30,000 meters of positive vertical elevation gain. I'm hoping it's in 70 odd kilometers. <laughs> Pretty chilly the, this morning. It's snowing. Didn't expect snow. Gonna get off the mountain, the weather has turned a bit bad. Definitely very chilly up here now. It's pretty boggy underfoot. As you can see, some proper snow. Very, very chilly. Carrying much heavier packs for the stretch of the commercial berg so we can carry a tent and sleeping bags. And we made it to camp. It's a 3 a.m. very chilly tent. I don't think I've been this cold in a long time. As you can see, lots of snow still. Making things very slow moving. Pretty much snow the whole reach line. Epic but slow going. I think you'll pick up the clouds down there. Yeah, pretty stoked to finally get back to Telebridge Border Post. Um, yeah, it's been like 16 days, one hell of an adventure, um, some crazy memories, and I'm sure it'll take a few days to, to sink in, but yeah, really, really happy. Um, like, yeah, so many challenges along the way, so it's quite a, quite a relief in many ways to, to make it back here in one piece. Biggest challenge was definitely the high mountain section, just the extreme weather conditions just being extremely cold, rainy and, and snow. Um, and I think because we had horses with us for a, a certain section, there's obviously a certain amount of responsibility. So like all the decisions you make, you feel like it's uh, taking other people into account. Um, it's not just yourself. So that was really challenging. And up there, there were some really, really cold nights. Um, a few nights to be honest like just shivered the the whole night um, completely out of my comfort zone and yeah I was actually quite quite scared I wasn't gonna gonna make it through one or two of of those those patches so um, yeah that was that was definitely uh, my biggest challenge yeah so navigate the street two took us 16 days six hours and 50 something minutes um, I think it was just over a thousand one hundred kilometers and lots of elevation. I think it was ended up being about thirty one or thirty two thousand meters of, of elevation gain. Yeah, if, if, if I could give anybody advice for, for a multi day challenge like this, I think firstly to choose your partner, somebody that you that you get along with and, and good friends with, um, because it does really get tough out there. Uh, to do your homework, uh, to do as much research as you, as you possibly can, but then with that also being flexible, like very little of what we planned actually worked out, so you must have an open mind. 